for my whole life when I'd go to voice class and it was exactly how I feel when I come out of a session with a counselor. I was speaking with a counselor here at Adelphi and I found out that I had anxiety and the first thing that she encouraged me to do is was to use my art. Art is always evolving and people are always evolving with the art so I truly believe that if we're trying to grow and trying to get better then we're in effect healing ourselves and you know that that's the best thing that you can do so I, I do believe art heals and I believe that it heals a lot. My name is Alexa Nisi. I am 20 years old. I am a junior at Adelphi University. I am a communications major with a minor in psychology and dance. I went to an incredible high school. I went to LaGuardia, which is the famed school in Manhattan. I'm originally from Staten Island. I feel like I owe a lot to dance. I've learned so much about myself through it, so much about other people through it. It has healed me, and that's why I'm so passionate about it. But I've also seen how I could heal others with it. And I think that is just so powerful. My name is Richard Bedard. I'm a psychology major at Adelphi. I'm getting my graduate degree in May. I feel like the arts has made me able to understand that no matter how you were born and no matter how you live, that everybody has the right to express themselves in the way that they feel is the best for them. And I feel like that's one of the most important things that art has done. Here is Dr. Josh Alden, the Associate Director of the Student Counseling Center at Adelphi University. I think that any form of expression, whether it be through writing, through dance, through singing, through acting, um, is potentially a cathartic experience. We're thinking of creative ways to help people, and I think that if people become more open to these ways, there's going to be a lot of benefits to them. Hi, I'm Rihanna. I'm a junior music education manager at Adelphi University. Um, I majored in voice um, in high school at LaGuardia with Alexa, and together now we um, run Arts and Power Adelphi. We basically are all about bringing arts to places where there aren't any. Specifically for children who don't have access to the arts, for children who come from underprivileged neighborhoods that don't have art programs, or children who um, spend most of their young lives in hospitals. We're trying to um, even the playing field and give them an opportunity to take part as well. I'm a professor here in the dance department. I danced professionally for 21 years. Um, 15 of those years were with the Paul Taylor Dance Company. I think dancing can definitely be accessed by anyone. You're, if you're alive, you're in a body. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you can, you can use it to the best of your ability. Dancing with Alexa has really changed my life because it's one thing to dance alone and that it's another thing to dance with somebody else. Yes, art does something for the individual, but together it feels so real and it feels so dynamic when you realize that there are two different ways of, of experiencing the same thing. And combining those two things, it really, it really makes it special and it really makes it amazing. And Richard Bedard, as much as he says that I have changed his life, he has changed my experience at Adelphi. And 
I am just so, so grateful that our paths have crossed. I believe that dance res is restricting, that not everyone can dance. If you can't stand up, you can't dance. If you can't move your arm, you can't dance. And that's not true. I definitely believe in um, art therapists. I think that it helps create new neuropathways for healing. I just love that the arts give that ability to create another form of expression that people maybe are comfortable with sharing. It made me more a more confident person. I was very, very shy. Anybody could feel better after singing their favorite song or painting something pretty, and anyone could feel the benefits of art education. It's home. I can order in a restaurant and make eye contact with a waiter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Artists come together of all different disciplines, music, dance, everything. Um, they're an unstoppable force. So if I could create more understanding throughout different people, I think that's going to be the biggest thing because with understanding others, we get closer. We become aware of what other people go through and we know that we're not alone. Art heals. Art heals! Art heals. Art heals! Art heals! And art also heals. Art heals. Art heals! So, if you didn't hear it before, art heals!